Hello, welcome to another interesting episode on Trash It. Now, the topic we're going to be trashing today is about our gender. Because I know some of the men that come on this show, they're always like, oh, Celia, you guys never criticize yourselves, okay? But today, we are going to be talking about our gender, the female gender. Honestly, some things that we do, I just can't believe it. It's it's gobs- <laughs> It just makes me like, are you serious? Can a woman really do this? So now listen to this story, okay? Okay, it says, your girl is in soup. I met my first love in 2013. He was everything I wanted in a man. After one year, he traveled. We also made out during the time he was in Nigeria. So in 2015, he bought me a car. Like he gave someone the money and it was presented to me on my birthday. He was sending me monthly upkeep. After about a month, he proposed on the phone to me. He asked me to marry him and I accepted. In 2017, I met my husband, okay? So now the guy she was talking about that proposed to her that bought her a car is different from the person she's now calling her husband. So she said, in 2017, I met my husband. We dated for three months and then we got married. We kind of had a low key wedding. My boyfriend, which is the one that proposed to her on the phone and bought her a car, was still in the picture. So later he said, that is the boyfriend told her to look for a land for them to buy. And she did. But when she bought the land, she bought the land in her husband's name. Okay. Because she didn't know how to go about it, buying the land in somebody else's name. So she decided to buy the land in her husband's name, even though her boyfriend gave her the money for the land. The guy does not know I'm married with three kids because now she's now had three kids for her husband. Okay. I truly okay. still love him, but I don't know how to face him because he's going to be home soon. How do I go about the land? Because he came back in the same 2017. We stayed for three weeks in a hotel, although at the time I was preparing for my wedding. So the guy came back from abroad in 2017. But this girl was preparing for her wedding and she stayed with the guy for three weeks in the hotel before she got married. In fact, I don't know what to do. I jokingly asked him, I jokingly asked him if he comes back and I'm married, what would he do? He said, I will, he said he will kill me and move on that if he can't have me, I better be dead. Now I don't know what to do because this guy will drag me. I don't know if he would accept me and my three kids. I am ready to leave my husband. <laughs> As for that car, that's what my husband is using. And also the land. We later sold the land for 20 million naira. But something happened and we lost the money. I don't know what to do. So basically, she's, they've now sold the land. And on top of that, she has lost the money. Maybe they try to invest it or something and then they've lost the money. So she does not have the money for the land to give back to the boy. She's married with three kids. The car the boy gave her on her birthday is what her husband is using. So yeah, Ajika, let me come to you. Our gender, our gender. How do we resolve this issue? Like, how can somebody even do such a thing? I don't understand what she was thinking. Please help us out. Maybe you can... In fact, to me, it's just it's just a very very strange story. It's really, really strange. I really hope it's true. That's where I am because I can't believe. You know, there's something that I read something today that I you know people behave, people think up to the level of their is it their mindset or their I don't know what it may be. You know, some people there's something that some people just do and you are wondering that are they okay? Are they normal? That's the only thing I can say because how can you be married? You have a boyfriend somewhere, you know, my then about how would the guy for how many years please that she had these three children? Even she's giving birth every year, even she's giving birth every year, and this your body will change. I've been, I gave birth almost nine years ago, I've not lost the weight. <laughs> True, because yeah, as you lost the weight, I'm not, I don't know how other people are doing it, so I've not lost the weight, I'm still battling it. So, definitely, it's better that. And when I before I gave it to my son, they were calling me fat, then can I imagine now? 
So something would, something would have, as in you will know now, I mean, is a man blind. A lot of people that used to do those long distance relationships for many, 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 many years. How are you doing this? I can't understand for the life of me. I don't understand. As in, for me, when I was as young as, I was still telling my sister, it was it yesterday, that I was as young as, I can't even remember, maybe like eight, nine or seven, when my mom used to tell me that, you know, you can't, once you are dating somebody three months, no headway, kick him to the curb and be going your way. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I was that young as in my mom was just like, see, you don't talk. I mean, I never really believed in all those long, long term relationships, all those relationships that some people that have been dating from university or for when they were small. Ah, me and that one is, is long thing. Long, 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 long thing. It's rubbish in my eye. But some people do it. I got the, I've noticed that a lot of people that go to private university these days, they marry, they date through school and they marry. It's, mm. it's still a miracle to me, but hey, people are doing it. They are now be dating somebody. He gave you money for land. Okay, why you even not give you money for the land? You don't have sense to buy it in your own name. Must they buy it in somebody a man's name? Oh, no, my God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. For me, I, I, I'm, I'm finding it difficult to, you know, I'm not saying it's not it's not a true story, but, you know, maybe just from where I am or the kind of person I am, there's just something that I don't believe are true because... For me, it's unrealistic. If somebody even gives me money, I will buy it in my name. Let's say I even still love the guy. I love the guy. I turn it around. I want to kill myself. I will buy it in my name. When he now calls back, oh, she it's me you love. Eh, I put it in my name. Must it be in his name? Then is it that the guy doesn't have any relative in Nigeria at all to know that you have married, you are give birth? This is Nigeria, all of us are like <laughs> age. True. I went somewhere yesterday, and so okay, I was at a pop up yesterday. And so somebody I knew came, and I was introducing her to my own friend, not knowing that I have another friend that knows this woman very, very well. Unless when they say we are six degrees from knowing each other, it's very, very true. Mm. There's always somebody that knows somebody before you know it's just like two, three, four people down the line. You already know somebody that knows somebody. So I don't know how the, the guy does. The guy does not have friends. Does not have family. To help him for that, this guy, this uh, Okweke, you live for uh, Nigeria. What's the be more? What's the better? One, two, three, not even one. You know, the Muslims are who's be like. I don't think so, but what? <laughs> Let's carry on. But if right. it's true, you'll be a better person. I know. Even even when I read the story, I was just like, "Come on now, this is so ridiculous." Did somebody um, just write this up? But you know, sometimes, you know, some women think they're very smart. Do you understand? And they think, oh, I'll play fast. So this could be true. I'm not saying the truth of matter. This thing can be very, very true. The only, the only reason why I would probably poke a hole in this story is because nobody knew the girl and the guys together to go and inform mm. the guy. Yeah. Because, because he said, she said that the car, when he gifted her the car, he sent the money to a friend and that friend bought her the car. So are you trying to tell me that that friend does not now know that this girl is married with three kids, no matter how low key that wedding is? Uh, except maybe they went to leave, maybe they left. It's, you know, it's also possible maybe they left the vicinity. Right. She left that area. Maybe they left like Lagos State. They went to believe in San Undo. No, like Jalingo. Or oh, ja, uh -huh. oh, Jalingo oh. somewhere because it cannot be even when you learn it there, they will catch you. They'll catch you. They learn it, they will catch you. No, no. Right. You must be living in somewhere inside one bush. Perhaps. <laughs> Tyler, let me come to you. What do you think about this story? As Ajike has said, it, it sounds very ridiculous. But with the way the female mind works, do you think this is what do you think about it? I feel like it's only an evil woman that can pull a stunt. Like. <laughs> I was about to say that. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry, Ibo, if you're watching this. But honestly, I just I'm just like, who? Like, how? Like, where? Like, honestly, like it it, it sounds utterly ridiculous. But at the same time, evil evil woman will pull this off clean, cleanly, like no doubt, yeah. Another thing that I was thinking is, yeah, she now got married somebody. She now married somebody that she has to, that they have to live off the boyfriend. Like, I used, like, 
Seriously, you know, they even say that okay, you left your abroad man for a decent, nice, rich guy that you know, you know, left abroad when the abroad guy will come, he will arrest all of you and put people in, 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 including the three children in a cell. Like, seriously, not only did you have you done all of this, you're living off this man, like, you sold his land, the car he bought you, the, your so called husband is like. How ridiculous. That's why I tell you that it's only an Igbo, a Igbo girl that can do such a thing. Because I'm sure if a Yoruba girl does it, yeah, she will leave that abroad guy for like one nice, clean mm. Yoruba demon. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, for the only of Ife. For the life of me, yeah, I really, when I was reading it, I was like, no, this can't be true. This mm -hmm. must have been made up because. But then, like Ajike said, it's really possible. Like, it could have happened. Like, it could have happened. Like, yeah. I don't know how these women pull it off because it's so much to keep up pretenses. It's a lot. So how do you... Like, I don't understand how you tear yourself away from being the doting, loving mother and, and wife to being this sweet 16 again that is having this boyfriend. Like, I don't know how they do it, you know. It's, it's, it's now what? So it's definitely not for me. I'll pass. Okay. I think I think the thing is, <laughs> some people just don't think. They make the first move and then they can't back out and then they just carry on. And then before you know it, they're in deep. They don't know what to do. And then they come on Instagram and start putting up the stories. But anyway, um, Shadi, let me come to you. What do you think about this? Because it sounds ridiculous, sounds unbelievable, but it's probably true. I think it's true. Mm. I don't think it's very true. We have a lot of girls that while we're in school, they're dating people in their abroad. I mean, that was years ago. So we're talking about 2015, 2017. So obviously we have phones, but maybe we don't have video calls like we do now. But mm -hmm. we do have mobile phones that people call each other on. Um, I'm with Tyler because the first thing that came to my mind is this girl is an evil girl because evil girls know how to snatch it back. They know how to get back <laughs> shape. I'm not even joking. I don't know what they eat. They give them the drink. I don't know. Their belly is flat again. They're like looking like they haven't even dropped any any children. So that's what I was thinking. And I thought of my Igbo friends while we were in school and how, you know, you find out like maybe like five people will buy the car, you know, but, you know, like they will collect money from five people, five different boyfriends. They, mm. you know, girls do this thing. So she was just going to um, eat a cake and have it at the same time. And that's greed. That is just, you know, while we were younger, we would just call it like, oh, she played the fast one on him before he played one on her. But as you get older and you have children, you have sons, you don't pray for some other girl to do that to your, your children. Son, yeah. Like, oh, you know? So like me, I'll turn to witch. Everybody knows that. I'll just turn to witch and me and the girl will <laughs> rack it out. Anywhere. It's just greedy. <laughs> that has caused this girl's problem. I'm laughing because it's something that, something similar I've heard before, where she should have stopped was when she got married, but the money was too sweet. She's a thief. She's just a thief. Because, and then the mumu, they call them MAGA, when I was growing up, the MAGA abroad, would just keep sending money without, you know, evidence, like you said, my my family should have gone, or I'll send you to my family, go and see my mother, go meet my brother here, introduce yourself. Mm -hmm. Except maybe he's an Akudaya, doesn't have any family too, that you just, is a ghost, you know, mm -hmm. some people, a ghost. Ghost. he just appears from one city to the other, because I don't understand how you'd be dating someone, be giving someone so much money, money. Asking them, what, what about your parents? What about your mother to buy a land for you? Why are you giving it to a woman? Like that. There's, a, there's so, a connection. Hey. Not someone, nobody lives in isolation like okay. that. Just... If, I, if we know how we know the girls of nowadays, how they behave, how they function, maybe they put this guy in a bottle mm -hmm. that anything you give me. Because listen, yes, it, it, it happens. Is he? Yeah. I, I personally do not believe in Juju. <laughs> I hear. Personally... Because I, a lot of people, I, I personally do not believe in I, that. I'm one of, I'm a strange but, Nigerian. I, I don't I, watch all those. Okay. <laughs> I've had a friend before, well educated, she's even in politics, that has told me something that, ah, oh, there's one babine on those states, and they said, if you talk 
there are girls that are into those kind of things that they will just yeah. collect no money from me. Men. Me, I, just, I just feel that they are just they've just got a maga. It's not because they went to any baba, it needs to be baba. They just got a maga that just wanted to that just like them. That was Kaya Mata test. Why is the girl that is selling Kaya Mata that was going all over the place uh, going to Dubai up and down? Yeah, right. I did not cast her. But Kaya Mata yeah, is no. not it's sweet now. It's different. This is the mistake most people are making. Kamata is not jazz. I told you that I was telling you one thing about blue eye. One blue eye something. Some people carry up and Blue eye. I don't. I don't know. I mean, I'm not. I don't roll like that. But I. I. I think that some people are lucky enough to to find men that you know listen to them and give them do their bidding or whatever it is they may do. They may want. But for this particular story, where the the story just shattered for me was you can't if somebody cannot give you that kind of money, you won't tell is most Nigerian men are attached to their mothers. Yeah. The ones that now don't have mother, they will have one sister, one auntie somewhere. Yeah. Or one yeah. uncle. Yeah. You can't be giving you money. They will you now buy land. For is if I should go say that what about what? if the guy is handicapped? Is what? Handicap. Which kind of handicap will be? We give you so much money. We just are you are you handicap that they tie so, you somewhere? It might be that the guy has one problem that you know he finally found this girl that oh my god this girl is in love with him and that's the reason why he's acting. There's no problem because she says she loves her. She loves this one that has money. Then now she <laughs> loves the money. Oh, you think she loves him and then she marries somebody else? Loves the money. It's the money. <laughs> she loves. She's a thief. She's a thief. She's a thief anyway, anyway, whatever the case may be, she's a thief, and that I, I don't know why. Well, there are people like that anyway. I think there are people that just think everything is about money, and mm. you, you just find a way to make money their load and save your other than that. Because I personally, <laughs> I was still telling someone that okay, I think it was my mom I was discussing with that. You know that this thing they call marriage is not sex and it's not money. Mm. Marriage is not sex. All those people, all those single people, like, okay, ah, when I marry, I will, oh, you go tired. You, you will just see that they are, as in, I, I, don't, I don't know for other people, I don't think, I think I was still, I was still listening to Pastor Kingsley and Mildred, I think it was Pastor Kingsley and Coco. It's not, it's not going to be the big, what will happen when, when all is said and what, are you people friends? Yeah. Are you people friends? There, are some, there are some couples I see and I actually wonder, what was the attraction? Mm. Because they don't even talk. Yeah. They don't talk. They don't have anything in common. Yeah. Like now, when I said, I'm so like me and my husband, we are opposed at parts. Funny enough, we are opposed. My husband can go to party, can be looking for party for me. Somebody still told me today that the reason why she's not invite me to parties is because she knows I don't like party. I hate, what's just a part? Before I say the tea at the back, I'm already having a headache. What will I wear? <laughs> which make up gay Oh, I know the Lagos uh, party, you must all deny it, you know, you make up what is not lost. Mm-hmm. But in as much as that, we can actually just sit down and just, just and laugh. But some people, they don't have that connection, so yeah. just money, children, and I don't even know what it, it may be. So, I because she has not said anything she likes about this person other than money. We have just said, he gave me, he bought me a car, yeah. and he bought me land. Yeah. And it's not, you know, it's not a good prerequisite. A lot of girls are just on this money matter. Mm. Money, 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 but, money. Yeah? But Ajike, money, uh, money works. So let's not... I, I like <laughs> money. Don't, don't get me wrong. I'm the queen of liking money. Very truthful. But you have to money have, is good. You have to have a common... I don't know how to... But you have to have a that, common... Wait, for me, it's not even this money, money, money. It's how stupid yeah. she is. Right, so it's giving you all this money. You're not developing yourself. Yourself. You're not establishing yourself. You're not doing things that. She in case she wasn't in the husband's the, the husband she married. Because people see why I say she's evil girl. Because for me, why I say she's an evil girl. Because evil it, girls can be that backward as well. No, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> but you push not come. <laughs> anyway, back to what I was Trickle. saying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my God, Tana, is he just saying that? They're going to come for you. Anyway, so my own thing is that the audacity, hmm? audacity mm-hmm. is the word, yeah. that after collecting all that money, you your husband is now driving the car. Yeah, exactly. The man does not have shame. 
the fool of a husband. No, the man doesn't know. He doesn't no, know. But, I the man should have asked where do you get all this money from? What about if she had Igbo girl that would I should stop with this Igbo thing? Yeah, you should. But what about if the girl yeah has you know fabricate, fabricated one story to say, oh, you know, my uncle gave all me right. this money, or this is a land that was their uncle. It's always their uncle. Ah, yeah. it's never their father that gives them things. Yeah. This uncle that has no name that is abroad. The yeah. Bible she might move on exactly with the old with the boyfriend and I'm telling the uncle. uncle is the uncle. Yeah, the one I told you send me money to buy that uh, um land that you know that you know this is just I can't even I don't pray to miss such girls. I pray my children will not know such women. Mm -hmm. because, uh, if if he kills her, <laughs> it is justified because then if he doesn't even kill her, it doesn't kill her, it's not kill her. If she has caught him for another woman. Because he will have trust issues till he dies. Yeah, exactly. If exactly. that story is true and he's giving her money like a fool, because he doesn't have fool as well, God will not allow us to born or dead, like Ajike said. I don't know that I mean, you yes. that will not say, I'm dating a girl for the past three years. Please go and find her house. Please go, you know, even buy her video video phone so that you can see her face. Are you not yeah. dying? Are you telling him that you walk in a crutch? What kind of story was she saying? And now, and now that's why the story is a bit iffy as well. Yeah. There's just too many elements to mm. it. Like, where do you put your kids when you're having a conversation with them? You know, I'm sure there's a time where you've been on the phone with him and your husband has come into the room, darling, or honey, or whatever. This girl. Who do you say that is? She was, you know, like. You say she's walking. This girl is weak. How do you explain your weight? As Adika said, of course, there's nobody that has given birth that will not put on one. Even if you're the slimmest person, there will be a change. Mm -hmm. say, be honest, how do you explain? I, I watched I watch some of her videos. <laughs> nah, 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 she, be, no, be, nah, she was not like this. Too. She too, even the almighty Beyonce, she was not like this. No, she wasn't, exactly. She wasn't like this. There will definitely be a change. So I don't... I, it's weird. It's so weird because the guy himself, he's got questionable character, like, how are you spending for this person that you don't really know what's going on? And you remember on the message the girl wrote, she said she had asked the man if if he found out that maybe she had she married somebody. somebody else, and the man said, "I will kill you and go because I can't. You if you can't be with me, basically you can't be." So for this woman, what kind of danger do you think she has put herself and her family in? If this man comes back from abroad and finds out that she's already moved on, she has three children already. This is why I'm saying that this guy, there must be something wrong with him. It might be physical. Because you know how all these people that are not quite right upstairs, like maybe he's, that, there's definitely something wrong. Because who would answer a question like that? that I will kill you and move on. You must be psychotic or, you know, there's, there's definitely something not right that you're keeping this relationship. And she must have, he must have been abroad at least six years for her to have had three children, mm. married, three kids. Ah, yeah, something is dodgy. Maybe the guy is even in jail. Seven years ago. Have we thought about it? What no. about if this guy is in jail abroad? Well, he won't be able to the get money that, that money. Sent, yeah, but the money that he sent her, he might have been that he got... <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking of hush <laughs> <laughs> for judging this relationship it might have meant that he did some dodgy business before yeah mm -hmm. got the money and said okay you hold on to this for me and then he he got caught unfortunately he hasn't been able to come down because obviously he had bought the land before she got married mm -hmm. do you get so now now he's not stuck in prison now that and, and he's waiting for his release date hypothetically speaking yeah so this guy is probably he has probably learned all sorts of crazy things in prison that's why he said if you try it i'll kill you yeah, uh, because i that girl you she go chop breakfast <laughs> nigeria that like, is coming to invest in it, you might be right with that theory or you know like some relationship are quite weird some people call themselves once a month and there's then they say they're in a relationship there's some people, there's some weird relationship like that. There's some men that will be like, I'm very busy, blah, 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 blah. No, nah, that's but nonsense. That's, that's not a relationship. That's not a relationship. I know, but there's some people <coughs> so accept it. And in this lady's case, because she knows she's married, she might not really complain except when she needs money. Because she's just fooled with the thought that she wants to just take money off him. Off and the guy. That you should have known when to stop. Three weeks to your wedding, you were still with him in an hotel. Yeah. Like, firstly. 
they they I don't understand how women do it. I can't. The girl get mind though. She I get can't. Deep mind. You know some girls there eh, they would double this and they would not catch them. People like me catch me. Yeah. So I don't try it. But, but, a... but you see, when you're double dating, you're having to sleep with two different people yeah. at the same time, isn't it? Like, yeah, but she hasn't been sleeping with two different people. That's no, no, she hasn't been. Oh, is it even possible that this man abroad is already married? He has a family there as well. That's another theory. Theory. That's why yeah. he's not so bothered. Yeah, and that's why he hasn't come home for since mm. 2017. Because the last time he came home was 2017. 17. Before the girl got married. And that was when she apparently, I think, bought yeah, the land. Possible. He you might know? be sending out his papers, might be going through stuff. Yeah. Is yes. it but you know we don't know but we just we just know both of the imagine imagine if that guy doesn't have papers yeah mm. and he's been walking 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 sending the money to say ah this lady invest for me and mm. this is how he will really kill her of course hey. yeah. he and will it's kill her unfortunately it's justifiable I'm sorry absolutely Man, I don't know, but... <laughs> Listen, I the way I am right now, when I see some things happening to some people, karma, I don't really like, I, I look beyond what people say. I see yeah. a young girl in mad. I'm thinking, hmm, you don't go do something when you're no, supposed I, to. I agree he should mess her up, but I kill her. She's got children now. We don't know. But... You, see, you see, but the thing is, though, the thing is, though, that's why when people are doing things here, yeah, you need to think of how that's going to affect the other person. Because yeah. now, yeah, let's analyze this, yeah? Tanya, let's analyze this. Because <laughs> now, <laughs> she's left this man, right? The man feels like he has a fiancé. Because let's not forget, in 2013, he proposed he to proposed. her. And she accepted. So as far as he's concerned, he has a fiancé in Nigeria. So for that reason, he can buy her a car, because that's my wife-to-be. Yeah. I can send her money to buy me a land. Yeah. Because that is our investment, our family yeah. investment. Yeah. And now, this girl met someone. What kind of a girl is she, anyway? Doesn't that speak about her character? Absolutely. You meet somebody, and just three months after dating, you marry them. I mean, hey, Magica, isn't that, and I, I know, isn't that a bit too soon, though? Three months later, you're marrying somebody you just met three months after. That's a bit, that's a bit fast, isn't it? So doesn't that I mean, speak about her character? Uh, me, so, when it comes to meeting, this meeting, I remember when I was investing in, when we go for one holiday or something, I say Christmas, but you know, you see some people come, they've come with rings, some people even come back with belly. So some people, I don't know, they they, they arrange that marriage for them. I don't know. <laughs> it's very possible. It's very, very possible. I don't know, but you know, this, I mean, I don't think that the issue I mean, with the is tilting towards a particular tribe in Nigeria. And you know, it's just it just has their rights in hand right in right. Because you know people they no matter what those they engage you from far 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 away. Yeah, you cannot come home and come and do Bella Nigeria with you. What are you doing here? I mean, just hang <laughs> yourself. Your just family, you. your families will meet each other, even if they're both stuck abroad. The one is stuck. You know, with all these things. I don't know. For me, it's just a very strange story. It can't be true because we have I've heard stranger things. Yeah, it's yeah. very possible. But I just feel, you know, she 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 what she did was very bad. You don't. You know, I think. I, I was still telling my mom, I think I was talking to my mom today, and I said that, you know, we need to just marry, by God's grace, personally, I pray for my son will marry a kind person. Mm -hmm. I mean, he should be a kind person, because some people are not just kind. Mm. She wasn't kind, whatever it may be, she was not kind to this guy. She no. was not kind. She was but not truthful. She, she did not honor him in any way, shape, or form. You know, he gave you a car, you marry somebody else, he gave you money again, you bought the land, you didn't even do it with sense, you buy it in your own name, you're buying it in another man's name. You understand? And the, the reason she might have done that is because of maybe sentiments towards her children. This is the father of my children. This is the father of my children. So you understand, not those kind of funny, funny, weird things. I just, I don't know. I just, I believe we should be kind, we should be nicer to each other, we should try, I don't know. Because if the, if the man comes back and sees everything has happened, this is what could drive someone to literally kill the woman and kill her children. It, it, it can drive some people mad, though. It's, it's can and it can, you know. It's, it, 
Many people me, I'm already picturing the guy as a madman, as in the person abroad. I'm already picturing him that mm, this guy was be what inside all those smoke, inside cold. Inside cold. Inside cold. Inside cold. Inside cold. Inside cold. Oh, don't, oh, your hand don't turn to leprosy and because of cold. You want person to come and tell you a story. Yeah. <laughs> and the thing <laughs> is, and the thing is, sorry, had invested the money and it, she was striving, you know, even if it comes to this um harassment, she can say, okay, take, take, you know, like this is what I, you know, maybe that we won't stop. She, she has nothing to show. She has nothing, nothing. to show. Yeah. Uh, she has nothing to show. And the know. thing is, what I was trying to say a, a minute ago is when people do something, yeah, you can't expect somebody to react in a certain way because you don't know how much it hurts that person. Yeah. Right. So, for example, now, if this man comes and finds out what has been going on and he decides to kill this woman, people are going to say, ah, is it not just money? It wasn't enough for you to kill her. But then do you understand what he had gone, what he's emotion. gone through mm -hmm. and what he has had to sacrifice? And now you are my fiance, but you have three children for another man. It's just like the topic we, we trashed here a while ago, a few weeks back now, where we talked about this woman that the husband told her not to not to have, they shouldn't have children yet. Do you remember that? Oh, yeah, yeah. That they were yeah, trying to yeah. save. Mm. And then it took quite a long, a few years, and not knowing that the man was having kids. Yeah. This, this is a similar situation, you mm. know, because what do you, what is the man going to come back to? Because for all you know, he has put all his trust on saying, okay, this is it. This is who I'm building with. I have an investment. At least I have a land. If I don't build on it, I can sell it and use the money to do the something. Yeah. But as, as Shade said, the money is not even there. Hmm. The land is not there. The woman is not. So you're not getting anything. So imagine even if maybe the woman was still there, but then she had squandered the money for the land. The man can still say, okay. Let's mm. try and start again. But the woman mm. is not there. The land is not there. There's no money to show for what you've done with the land. And now you now have three children and a whole husband. If, well, if that was your... Well, forgetting the husband in this story. Yeah. Does she think that she will not lose the husband? Even though I don't, I don't no, think she will lose the husband. Yeah, but I the husband is Aruma Aru, Jerry. I don't think he's going anywhere. Well, why can't she explain to him that he's the man that gave us 20 million? So he's men, not going because... anywhere. The, man, the car that you're driving, he's the one that bought it, so he will just smell it. Maybe he's one die die man, God forgive me. Maybe he's one die die broke man. Hence the reason why, you know, I just think the woman is wicked. I don't, she's just all shades of wicked. She's wicked. Like, how do you do that to somebody that's mean beyond words? Like, mm -mm. and it's, it's even possible that her husband might even know where all this money is coming from. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right her husband might even know where this money is coming yeah. from and he would just be like well it's not like you are the man is sleeping with you yeah. he hasn't exactly. seen this since 2017 so exactly. i don't have anything to worry about exactly know? that's what yeah that's possible but if, if that was your, if that was your brother tyler let me come to you i'll come to everybody with that question if this man abroad was your brother or if the man at home how how what kind of how would that make you feel? And what kind of advice would you be giving to your brother if this person was your brother? If the man, if the if it was my brother abroad, I'll first I'll first slap him for being so stupid that you cannot even communicate with me to say, oh, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. You know, you you've been stupid, so you need to live with your stupidity. If the husband, the, the girl's husband now is my brother, I will slap him too because he's an idiot. How do you sit on your back? And allow your wife to be fending for you. I'm not saying that your wife can't fend for you, but where is all this money coming from? Have you have you questioned her? Mm. And you know, then you now have this money. Then you guys now lose it. Like, are you like the two men? If they were related to me, I would slap them because they clearly at this point don't have sense. It's only the woman that has sense, even though she's wicked, but she's the only one that has sense. They're just a slapper. Go away. <laughs> I mean, with, with this, with Shadi, let me come to you with the same question as well. If this person, if the men in question, if they were your relative, what would you, I mean, it's, I, I really don't know. It, it's, it's a difficult one, isn't it? How would you... it's, a, it's life. Shit happens, right? If it's my brother, he's probably learned his lesson the hard way. 
I will get I will get him help because he will need the help because it will, it will mess him up. If it's my brothers that I know now, how they love, it will mess them up. So I'll be focused on them, you know, and I'll just, you know, try and, you know, it's going to be hard for him to trust again. So it, my focus will be on my brothers. I call it bad debt. Mm -hmm. Sometimes sometimes you lose. This is a light lesson because already it's there. So they doesn't, if I ask for days to tomorrow, it will not stop any st a stupid man from being a stupid man. If he wants to be stupid the next, the next woman, there will be. There's a woman, there's a man that, Every time, someone's always breaking their heart. He's always acting stupid. So people will not still learn with this. So men will still go again and give another woman more mm -hmm. to a 50 million naira. So it's just to talk to him and look at where his head is at because he might be having issues. He might be slow. He might be, he might, he, you know, he might have, he might be vulnerable. There was something that is not clicking that will make me wonder, why did you do that? So that my focus will be my brother, the one abroad, you know, and that girl should not just come near me. Or I know where she lives. That's another thing. I mean, I, I'm not going to go on here and say I will slap her. But, but, you know, we know how to take care of such girls. But the husband in the house, that one, is that, that was my brother. I will take his head to Celestian Church for them to wash his head. <laughs> not even joking. They will wash his head for me in the river. Not even just three times. <laughs> for the next seven years. Because God forbid mm. somebody is a killer. That's a killer. She can kill him. Yeah. How many years now? Do I even know that the first child is mine? What is going on? Yeah, because like, because she saw him three weeks to their wedding yeah. or a few weeks to their wedding. So yeah, it's possible that that first child is not even his. I would advise him to do a DNA first because now that's what that. If I said we should stop doing DNA because most of the children now they, they don't they, they with the wrong father. So, mm -hmm. but me, I would advise my my brother if that was my brother to go and do DNA on the first child and every other children after that because <laughs> after that we might think it's the only abroad that she has that nonsense, but she might be doing Nigeria as well. Exactly. And, you know, I was coming. Let me. Give, I'm going to be honest. I was coming to defend this to make it look. At, nicer than you know not to be with the crowd and say okay but i can't justify this wickedness it's I just wicked, like I have children i have sons i cannot to me this is just evil you know because yes you can play the game when you're not married but you need to put a stop to it when you're married we can say okay she doesn't, she doesn't trust him he's gonna abroad he might have girlfriends so decided to keep not put all our cars in one basket. I hear that. But the, the, the minute you decided, look, I'm going to marry this guy and start having kids, you should have cut that off and just, you know, tell him, I'm sorry, I got married. Let him deal with his heartache. All those years, the poor guy thinks he has a wife. If he's an evil man, he's not a fiance, his wife. Wife, yeah. Thinks he's got a wife. It's such a shame. No, God will not allow me to have brothers like that or a son that will actually be yeah. both of them. No, I can't. I so I'll, I'll be supporting my brother and the one abroad if he's the one that's just giving I mean mommy is there, daddy's there, everybody is there, you can't give them the money. To foolish people, so I don't know. <laughs> you say you're not related. I, I, not to to oh, that's I don't have any advice. Uh, you cannot have me as your sister and be foolish, you know. It's not possible. <laughs> yeah. I don't have no comments. We don't want no comments. Let's see. So now the other question the lady was asking, I mean, she's willing and she said, you know, I'm happy, I'll, I'll be willing to leave my husband if he will take me and my three children. Is that, Talia, do you think that's a fair comment? I mean, at the end of the day, you know, even though she has spent his money, she's gone and married somebody else and now has three children, but she still loves him <laughs> to the point she's willing to leave her marriage. She doesn't love him. him. She loves his money. You see, when I was saying that, it's with, the husband is probably one Aruaru guy, like he's one die, 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 die broke. That's the reason why she wants to leave her husband and go to that man because he has money and he can look after her. He's been looking after her, you know. But how dare her even say, I would, that lady said, she's just, how dare her even say that I'm ready to leave my husband for him? Like, are you, is she that wicked? I think, what kind of, who, who birthed this woman, sir? Like, seriously. Audacity. That's why he's audacity. The audacity. The so mm. huh. What kind of human being? Uh, like, you don't, she doesn't even have any sympathy. She's not even, no. she's not even so bad that she has done this. She's no. saying, I am willing to. I hope Nigeria gave her advice. Nigerians give her advice because she doesn't even deserve, what kind of foolish advice 
like oh I bet. let me stop here because Mm -mm. Shady, let me come to you with the same thing. But when you look at it, she's 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 ready to make amends, isn't she? What amend? What are you talking about? <laughs> it's the audacity, the effrontery for me. And then she that's why I'm saying that maybe I need to have my brother checked to see if his brain is okay. Because if she now comes up again with that story of saying, eh, okay, now we've done what will happen then. So and I have three children. I know you didn't know about them, but can you marry me? Because mm. you know my children she's not even scared that i will poison her with the children mm. as in, is she okay is she okay i don't think the girl is okay herself but then we might have some daft human being too that would take her to the yeah. children i don't understand there's some things that i can't even answer that question it's the audacity for me at least she had invested that money on some sort of business or something right maybe she would have made had a return by now and i think the most important thing is knowing that the guy is abroad knowing that the guy is abroad and she was going to buy the land and she bought the land in the i don't I, I really don't know how she was thinking or what how she was processing ah uh, i see the reason why she wants to leave her husband now you know yeah. everybody is jackpying <laughs> she's ready to jackpot Oh, right. okay. So yeah. she's ready to be interested. Oh, my God. Anyway. I give her children the best life abroad with a foolish man that might still take them. With a, you you don't see them now. She's, yeah, she's, no. she's in, in fairness, she is quite clever. I mean, she's pulled this off for all that year. No. You it's know, not I, kudos to her. She's done well. She's really, cool. really pulled a fast one over that other man's eyes and even her husband's eyes. Her husband's eyes. <laughs> Will lose both men. She will lose both she men. She will lose her. both men because she's an idiot. Because she obviously didn't think it through. She didn't think about the consequences. She thought she was gonna get away with it all the way, but unfortunately, it doesn't work that way. Well, One she day. might not lose both men if her husband at home knows what she's up to, and he's agreed to it. I know. Yeah, me. You, what, I, what about if the man has agreed to it because of what he was benefiting, which is the money and stuff? When he realizes that she's gonna lose that other man or she loses that other man, he might be like, you know what? Well, actually, I don't trust you because this is what you've been doing all these years. Yeah. Bye. Mm. Yeah, that's true. Well, uh, anyway, I guess. I guess it's a if that man. If that man was a Yoruba man. <laughs> I don't want to keep calling tribes. No. That man will forgive oh, the husband. He will <laughs> forgive. What people know how to do kafiche te kule. E kule means let's, let's cover our shame. Ah. They know how to do it very well that they would, because they are also really? ashamed. So they will not tell anyone mm -hmm. that they are white eating. They can do that one. Oh, very wow. Well about that one. If they really love the woman or they want their children, they might not touch her again. But he will not tell anyone and he will not yeah, divorce. Ah, uh, you know what? Actually, saying that, yeah, I actually know of a story mm. that um I was told. I don't know if it's true, but I think it's true because I, I heard it from a very reliable source. Um, a young kind of youngish guy, um, obviously married to his wife, they're Yoruba, and um, he found out that the wife was having an affair with the, a bus driver. Mm -hmm. And um tried to keep it together but obviously did not touch her did not well he was still continuing to say that you know he's married every time you ask him how's my wife oh, my wife is fine the kids are fine yeah. was still living his life you know but did not like, like everything to do with that woman yeah he totally washed his hands off yeah. there's no there was no they live in the same house so they sleep in separate rooms in the uk that's just with mm. like he just was he's a very smart man it was is very expensive well they're going through a divorce apart from yeah. that time it just feels maybe but, wanted to just put everything in place but yeah. really no but it's most hard, anyway most he tried part, though because he tried most, to cover up what so like they are punishing that woman that's their own way of punishing her back. They will not touch her. They will, she's, keep, she's keeping her there for her children's sake only. Mm. They do everything as a man in the house. But if he's cheating outside, she dare not complain. Sometimes they will even bring it in the house, mm -hmm. you know, like some women will now be ashamed. So they, they, some Yoruba men find a way. They think that's the way of punishing the woman and getting back at her. Mm -hmm. One begging. 
to keep the marriage if she's not if she you know so, sometimes you cheat and be like okay yeah, so you know you catch me so well but sometimes the, the, the woman said they'll be like you know please don't tell the whole world so the man might know that she's cheating and just decided okay let's just be enjoying the extra fund coming from your boyfriend abroad mm -hmm. <laughs> i think i think the thing is for me i'm quite surprised that a woman <laughs> I know, I don't know. I know women do a lot of things though, but it's, if it was a man that did this now, I'm sure the com the amount of comments this post got would have it would probably would have gotten more comments of how a woman should not a woman should not suffer with a man, a woman should not do this with a man, and all of that. You know, although a lot of people were castigating her and insulting her, saying how selfish she was. Yeah. which she is but he only got about a thousand something comment com compared to if he was a man i think that at the end of the day what this woman i i, I really don't know what she's gonna watch what she's teaching her children if she's got a, a female child i don't know what kind of upbringing or what kind of what, what kind of role model she's going to be for her daughter or even her sons because mm. if they're old enough to know what's going on then I'm sorry, but how are they going to then move on in their own relationship? How are they going to trust their their girlfriends or their boyfriends, husbands, wives, and things like that? You know, Ajika, you're looking at me funny. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so did, did you have something to add before I round up? No, 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 no. Okay, so it, it's really and and the thing is, when I read this, I was very embarrassed. Like I, I was like, oh my god, why? How would? How can a woman do such a thing? It doesn't make sense. It's senseless. It's meaningless. All shades of wrong. But mm. again, I just I I suppose as people say, not only men cheat, a lot of women cheat as well. I think I'm gradually because I felt like more men cheat more than women women but mr jags always points it out and says no Celia, is 50 50. Hmm. Although I, still don't, be here now. I know although i still don't agree that the ratio is still 50 50 i think more men cheat than women hmm. but i don't know and this is a prime example of what some women can do that just, hmm. that, just well. hmm. sorry women cheat as well yeah, women do, unfortunately, especially married women. Imagine now, if this man comes from abroad now, this woman is going to go and meet him and probably sleep with him and then come back home, you know? Mm. So, come back pregnant. People like that, they used to get pregnant very easily. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and then give and then give the children to, to, the, to the husband at home. The husband. <sighs> anyway, on that note, we're going to end it. Thank you guys for joining us. And I'll say to all the women out there, please do better because this is nonsense. Yeah. You guys yeah. keep smearing and smearing and smearing the few good ones, okay? Because sometimes it's very, some men will tell you that all women cheat, that, and you're like, but I've never cheated on my husband. And they'll be like, uh, okay, mm. keep keeping that secret. And, and you, you'll find yourself trying to defend, defend. Yeah, because, of the, because of the things that other women do. And this is a prime example yeah, of it. Personally, I don't feel you need to defend anything. But no, you don't. Because they're entitled to their own opinion. As long as they have not caused me doing... Even when they tell me, if they, somebody comes and tells me that this person is doing something, I've trained myself so well that I will not... What my eye does not see, my mouth does not see. Yeah. I think I've gotten to that point in my life. So I don't... I try not to carry rumors. I try not to... Sorry, I, I try not to spread rumors. I try not to say things that I cannot confirm. Mm -hmm. And what I, I have... I always tell my son is that what you cannot say in front of someone, try not say you cannot stand and defend it and say... Hey, try as much as possible to avoid it. So I think when people come and they say, I will make it, I will make it. I don't know what you saw, and that's on you. Don't drag me to your problems. Mm. Leave me alone. Yeah, and, and that's it. On that note, we're going to end it. Thank you guys for joining us, and we'll see you same time next week. Have a good rest of the weekend, guys. All right, bye. 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 -bye. bye, -bye.